short time ago, a truck from southwest Missouri, seen of much deadly flooding, arrived here to stock up with flood cleanup supplies. The Red Cross loading up that truck with several pallets of flood buckets. Those are buckets filled with bleach, squeegees, towels, mops, the sort of stuff countless people will need to begin the backbreaking work of cleaning up once the flood water there finally recedes. Now, beyond these supplies, the Kansas City Area Red Cross funneling something else to flood zones across Missouri, volunteers. So far, 49 from this area. That's a huge number, but it's just a start. It's a number that's going to go up. We would like the people that are affected to realize that there, we're there for them and we're going to go and leave our day to day work behind and come help them recover. Here's proof of that. Empty offices and cubicles inside the Red Cross headquarters here on Armour Boulevard. While most of the Red Cross workers now in the flood zones are traditional volunteers, what you're seeing here is that even the Red Cross staffers get into the mix when disaster strikes.